Welcome to the Void. My name is Liliana, also known as the Transfemling, and today we're going to get back into The Witcher 3. Now, uh, apologies, this is going to be uh, very late on Monday, but still Monday, as I said it would be. Um, I don't think I've actually shared pictures or uh, super good things or like images, but uh, yeah, I was helping my girlfriend move and I tried to lift up, tried to lift up a box, and I thought I had what felt like the handle to me. Uh, turns out it was just the lid, and then the lid came off, and, I mean, thankfully it was symmetrical, it took off both the, the ring finger nails, uh, but this one got really jacked up and yanked back, and it hurts. I was hurting a lot. I mean, it still kind of hurts, but now it's actually functional again. But yeah, so that's why, uh, this is very late. Again, apologies, thank you for your patience. There's also going to be a fun, uh, bonus episode of, not The Witcher 3, but just of, uh, uh something interesting that I'm very excited to get to. Uh, once I'm done recording this for today. So, uh, quick recap, we just cured uh, Avalanche over here of the curse, um, so this is what What's-His-Dick looked like, um, the short, short little friend. Yeah, it turns out it was an elf named Ava, um, Avalanche. And that's very cute. I heard something making noise, I don't know what that was actually. <laughs> um? But yeah, so we also, I did, um, I checked in with Quinn because, uh, I didn't want to spoil myself, but I wanted to, like, check about the, is, is this the end game? Are we going to be doing the end game things? And the answer is no, not yet. This is like a mid point or something. Can we talk? Can you help? Also, uh, apparently Lambert's the one who in the show got, like, Infected by a, um, whatever it's called, a leshy, leshin. I was like, that's why it seemed familiar. That disappointment I hear. No, surprise maybe. Most grow gentler with age. Seems you're growing pricklier. Mom always said I was different. <clears throat> Had some other adjectives in mind, but different will do. Different's better than boring. See you later. Yeah, take care. Uh, do I need to actually t yeah. ask you to help, or are you... That's an interesting, so, that's a good question. Feel any different after our encounter with the djinn? Yes. Now I feel... regret. Mean to say that... That I regret we didn't try that earlier. Much earlier. Think we would have argued less? Quite the opposite. But the other moments would have been more intense as well. Hmm. Moments like this. Cute! Look, I am... I'm a dork. I like seeing people be cute towards one another, and, like, I like romance. I like shit like that. So that's very cute. Even if things are weird a bit. Ever think about the past? About your time with the hunt? Wait, you spent time with the hunt? Amazed we survived. Eridan's not usually one to leave witnesses behind. That's just it. He didn't. Lost my memory when I escaped the hunt. Your famous amnesia. You didn't have it? For a short time only. Once the Emperor's mages got their hands on me, my memory quickly returned. Ah. Whoa! Yeah, that's a good starter what point. What did Aridin want from you exactly? The same thing he wanted from you. You don't recall? Draw a blank on most of my time with them. We were bait, Geralt. Both of us. Eridan believed Ciri would come for us sooner or later, and he would capture her. That's... you know? Fortunately, she didn't fall for it. When the hunt had Not a bad you, plan. Hope they didn't hurt you. Even if they did, I've no memory of it. The whole time was but a string of phantom images. Blood and fire. A wild chase through different worlds. All shrouded in fog. Though I do remember you coming for me, trading your life for mine. I hadn't the chance to thank you then. You'd have done the same for me. I'm touched by your certainty. But you've yet to tell me how you escaped them. Wouldn't mind knowing that myself. There are times I remember rushing forward, red riders around me. Next thing I know... What's a red rider? The woods at the foot of Kaer Morin. Was that just what the general foot soldiers of the hunt are called? How do you go from being the Emperor's hostage to being his ally? 
One day, the door of my cell opened, and instead of seeing the usual officer, I saw Emir. I'm he so sorry. to release me and grant me free reign of the Imperial Treasury, provided I did what he asked. He Fair enough. He told you about Ciri, and you accepted his offer. Why? Shared aims make for strange bedfellows. I knew I had to find Ciri before Eridan did. And if any man had the power and the means to help me, it was the Emperor. No, I can't blame her there. Once all said and done, he is her father. Um, I'll fight him, because I'm more serious dead than that dick is. Um, I don't really feel like going into this. That feels like it's going to be lots of Thanks, yeah. tension. I, I could do with some less tension, honestly. Okay, so I'm guessing when it says friends, it means people other than those who are actually, like, in the actual vicinity, because... Of course, those who are, you know, in Care More and are going to fight for, you know, themselves and make sure that, you know, they don't get killed. Do I have any shit to drop off? Uh. I know, rarity. Vico. Vicavaro Blade. That's a fun name. But, uh. Oh, did it unequip my... Cool, 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 cool. But why was Avalanche with her in the first place? And apparently Avalanche isn't a friend? Okay, so it did unequip my swords. Cool, good to know. Master sword, steel sword, crossbow, and then my other shit is fine. So I think, I, I, so as I was saying, I think I need to actually go to like, find Triss, for example, and um, hot tub mage with the her titties out, that, that lady, um, Zoltan. Other allies? Question mark? Who knows? Maybe now is a good time to do the DLC so that I kind of get some more allies that I can uh, round up for this. Don't actually know. That's just a thought. Just a concept. Just a theory. A very gay theory. But uh, we'll find out. Um, Dandelion, perhaps. I don't know how much use of Bard's sharp tongue will be against, you know, the steel and hides of the Wild Hunt. But who knows? Maybe he can pull off some D&D &D Bard type shit and, you know, actually fucked him up with just his voice, because that would be sexy. So, talk to your friends. Yeah, I'm gonna go... Wait, who... Oh, cool! This is actually very useful. This is very useful. I was like, God, I'm gonna need to fucking recall where people are, and I don't know where people are because there's a lot of them. Oh, I don't have to Dijkstra again. I don't like Dijkstra. Um, but you know, just go talk to these people that I've helped slash have been asked to help, and see what they do. Um, all right, yeah, there, there's been a lot of them, but there's just a, a quest tracker for each segment it looks like for everybody that like I have helped question mark I feel like maybe um some of the, some of these quests might update with more markers if I discover new allies possibly that would make sense at least in my head that would make sense because otherwise it'd be like oh hey cool I'm gonna go talk to this person who I've never interacted with before in this game and that wouldn't make sense I don't know, at least it wouldn't make sense to me. It would make video game sense. It wouldn't make actual realistic sense. And Witcher's an interesting blend of fantasy and attempts and stabs at realism. Because it's not like... It's not always realistic, but it's... Oh, Berenger's notes. Everything looks familiar. Berengar's. Papers have been lying here for years. Damn like a metal, a week sweating with bells and forge and 
And what do you know, there's for Torhern shining in my hand. And then there it goes, cracking into shards when th with the first practice strike. Must have botched something the alloy composition or cooled it too fast after forging. Hard to say, just gotta try again, I guess, but not here because Vesemir's already badgering me with his blasted words of wisdom. Should have known asking his advice was opening a bottomless can of worms. Don't know how Geralt puts up with his puts up with this without going the rest of the way crazy. How about that? He was working on a sword. And not just any sword, judging by his notes. Torhan. Ought to talk to Vesemir. Berengar consulted him. Vesemir might remember how far he got. That's fair. I'll work on that later. For now, I'm trying to find the quickest place out of here so I can go talk to people. Did we get this episode moving? Like with some forward momentum. Because Karen Warren's pretty, but I want to kill some shit. Talk to people. Thankfully, it won't need to censor Kira if she's in the hot tub again. Because I did the one thing. Also, I still need to go to the royal palace and play the- Apparently there's a noble who you can play Gwent against, but like he just vanishes or fucks off at some point, apparently. <laughs> Kira, where are you? Kira? This is Velen. Correct? Oh well, no, this is Velen. Right? Yeah, Valen, No Man's Land. Apparently I have lots of stuff uncovered still. I thought I had figured out most of the things. Oh, I might have gotten them from, um, like, other notes and whatnot. Temerian Partisan. Oh, no, I understand why now. Gosh, this map is just glitching massive. Where was she near, though, boy? Oh, she was in th that that's her right there. I don't know why she doesn't have a quest marker. I know, yes, yes, the quest, the curse, the yes, yes, yes. Also, I know it's actually Avaloch, but Avalanche is funnier. Ooh, spooky. Come on, come on, let's go. Oh, there's an orange? There's like an, an orange? Exclamation point? That's new. Oh, hey! Appeal to Sir Geralt of Rivia, the bridge is crest. Geralt of Rivia, at the behest of our merciful sovereign, his illustrious grace, Anna Henrietta, we have journeyed to the northern realms to lay before you our mission. A terrible monster has appeared in the Duchy of Toussaint, a, a beast that has committed heinous crimes against Her Grace's subjects. Only the most famous among witchers has the ability to destroy the beast. Thus we humbly beseech you to appear in the village of Holloway, where we shall await you in the full hopes that you will deign to hear of our woes and liberate our land from the clutches of fear. Your humble servants, Sirs Palmerine de Lafon and Milton de Periac Perrin, knights in the service of Her Grace and the Duchy. Well, I'll certainly take it. I mean, I'm not going to start them right now. I'm gonna go stick with the the other one. I'm gonna go talk with Kira. Talk to Kira Mitz. Talk to the bathtub sage. Your bath hot tub mage. That's what it was. <sighs> this place is so pretty. It is a weird mixture of very clearly a game, but very, very pretty, and very, very... It's very clearly a game, but it doesn't feel as much like a game as it might be expected. Hey, you're clothed this time! Geralt, just when I was starting to miss you. No, so only just barely. I can, like, see, like, you're... I adore you. Uh, we, I've, we've had all of these questions heard before. I finally know where Siri is. I want to take her to Care Morin. Is that so? Nice to hear. But is there Your hair's kind of getting all fucked up right now. Well, the wild hunt will know I've found her when I do. They'll attack. I want you to help me repel them. Ah. <laughs> this is awkward. I mean, I'd gladly help. I have a few more things oh, to do. Oh, do I have to do side quests to help all of you? Perhaps if you were to help me first. <laughs> Let me 
they think about it. You know where to find me? Uh, also, do you have any quest cards? You lived here left you a bunch of interesting sundries. She did indeed. I very much so. No. Oh, hey, and a reset potion for your builds. There's lots. You have lots of expensive stuff. Um. Okay. See you, Kira. I've already. I mean, I've already done this before, I think. Uh, do I need to talk through these again? So but we already know this. I'm in hiding, Yes. We we've already said this before. Changing this. Any word from any other sorceresses? None. Even tried to. Okay, we already know this. Is she glitched out? There's nothing. Tell me more. Never it. More. Well, we. Okay, so there's nothing See new. Kira. Maybe it's in my quests already, and I just I'm missing it. Secondary quest: a favor for a friend. Oh, okay, cool. I need it. that. Is, that's the thing. There's the the quest for getting her ingredients off the convoy. I was like, there's gotta be. A reason why she's like not giving me a like oh yeah sure just do this thing and just being vague about it hey, it's cuz I already had the quest on the road again now I leave cuz I'm just going through the fields hey you look like dick So speaking of uh, Mario noises, uh, apparently the dude who voices Mario also voices Parthenax from Skyrim, and this amuses me very. Th this this just amuses me a lot. We'll flail your skin off. <laughs> Bye, bitch. Okay, so, oh gosh. We'll transport first. Also, this looks like a new... Some of my favorites because they're vulnerable to fire, and I like using the fire sign. I'm a water sign, personally, for those who want to know. But I really like fire. But I'm. <laughs> Speaking of which, kind of, very tangentially. Uh, there's been. This is gonna date this episode a bit, but that's fine. There's been a meme I've been seeing a lot that's like. Or like a meme format of, she's a ten, but and then some random tr attribute, some very harmless, some very much so like, like oh okay that's a bit um concerning is certainly a word that you could use. Um, I was uh, at a get together for a friend's uh, birthday party, and uh, I was like. You know, my, my, my thing with for she's a 10, but mine would be, she's a 10, but she's absolutely obsessed with her girlfriends and fire. <laughs> Neither what you're, well, the girlfriend's part isn't. What, what are you, no. What are you doing, girl? Sorry, Roach, I didn't mean to just shove that dead guy's feet in your face. That could not have been pleasant. Well, here it looks like what could be some supplies. Do I just need to follow the skin marks? 
Okay, so looks like I do just need to follow the these for a second at the very least. I'm not seeing any red dots appearing, so it's not looking like a fight. At least not yet. Uh, also, how have all of you been? As I mentioned, I was helping my girlfriend yeah, move. Parts of traveling across Velen alone. No way that was gonna end well. There's something over here that's glowing bright red. Oh, a rat fiend! Oh, you're one of the. Oh, you're these one. You're you're these. You're, you're like. Instead of just dying, it, they're the ones that, like their heads explode, right? Oh no, that's a different one apparently. Hmm, different yet again. Human from an artery. Can't be far. Wouldn't have made it. Yeah. Package still intact. Don't sense it after magic so. though. Cuts of meat. I hope Kira will explain this, this one. Oh gosh. Wonder what spell requires that? That's a fun little interesting creature. From like D and D and yeah, things. I've waited for help. It never came. That's Velen for you. I'm sorry, friend. But there's a thing that's apparent. Well, okay. Correction. I know about it due to D and D. I'm sure it comes from somewhere. Um, but what was I called like Catabula Pass or something like that? It was like on the screen a second ago in the subtitles. But they're like. The best way I can think to describe it is they look like almost like a small dragon, but like a dragon if like, you know, red dragons are fire, white dragons are ice, green dragons are poison. It almost looks like it would be like a dragon of filth, because it's just like super scraggly, like it lives in swamps, and it's, it's actually, it's, it is a mammal, just it looks kind of dragonish because of like a very bulky body, kind of like the size of like hippopotamus, but it's like a long neck. Or longish neck with like a, a like a um like a warthog's face almost and then like this really fucking big like um clubbed tail and they're interesting if i remember right, i think they have just like an instantly kill you ability in D, D at least also this is just going off of what i remember seeing the um art for in the edition for D, &D. i haven't looked them up otherwise but they're interesting little things. Or I'm getting my things mixed up and I'm thinking something else entirely. Just when I, was starting to make. I got your package! Those, uh, substances you wanted. Splendid. I can finally begin my study of double arboreal racination patterns. But first I'm I don't understand all those words. Of mold wine. Saw what the wagon was carrying. Exquisite meats, expensive wines, Zeracanian spices. Not a speck of magic. Care to tell me what you're up to? <laughs> I would rather show you, but you must wait a bit. Sure, I suppose. Color me intrigued. Fine, I'll wait. <laughs> then shoot gonna outside. Gonna slip into something more comfortable. Later. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Oh gosh. Well, go on out. Cutscene, they're gonna fuck, probably. You've been patient, thank you. It's almost ready. <gasps> Friends! Huh. If I wanted to see white mice, I'd just get drunk. Note that I said almost. Now don't interrupt. The cane within people. You're like turning the people or something? Well, your island did just move. Oh, that's very Cinderella. Or not Cinderella. No, oh, yeah, Cinderella of you. Also, yeah, what happened to the third mouse? Third mouse? What happened to it? The spell has a 66.67% chance of success. I always use one more than I need, just in case. So Fair are... enough. Kira, can I explain what's going on here? Know the fairy tale about Cinderella? Mm-hmm. True story it's based on, too. A Zugul cropped up in a palace pond and ate Princess Cinderella whole. Left behind one slipper, so I beg you not another word about Zoogles. Mm, amazing. Now to return to the fairy tale. I'd like to escape these ghastly swamps for one magical night. I don't need a fairy godmother, I'll cast the spells myself. But I could use a prince charming. 
It just so happens you're the only decent candidate in all Vellum. That's really cute. Honestly, also kind of sad, but really fucking cute. <laughs> Amazing. Sounds tempting. So tempting, I don't think I can refuse. Once again, I'm so grateful for that censorship mod just so that I don't have to deal with censoring things out. Transform a pumpkin into a carriage? No. I shall transform our rancid rags into something more glamorous. Don't wince. It'll only be an illusion, won't hurt a bit. And at dawn, everything will... She's gonna be nothing but just... Nothing but lingerie. I'll be kind of entertained. Oh, yes, please, absolutely. Why not? Might as well go all out. Then hold on tight. Gvela Glan. So, what do you think? Neckline too modest? Yes. It's just right. Oh, I might also have changed your hair color while I was at it. I've always fancied dark hair, Ben. <laughs> oh well, any port in a storm. Well, off we go. Dinner's waiting. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Let's go. Oh, race here to the meadow. I mean, I w you said race, so race me. Well, race me, Kira. Hello, there's a hanging person right there. That's always pleasant. Yeah, no. yeah, yeah. Ah, fuck. Hey, Cinderella, we'll have a great fall. <laughs> as fast as you can, try to catch me. Well, there goes one of my theories. I had a thought that maybe, like, oh, the, like, racetracks were always, like, just a little bit longer than that horse stam stamina bar, so that you could, uh, well, wouldn't have to worry about, like, starting and stopping. Not the case, it turns out. I thought you were a better horseman. For the record, I was riding a mouse. <laughs> Trots around on a roach. That shouldn't present a challenge. She's got me there. Not gonna lie. Why I needed those substances. Yeah. Women and cloves, roasted capon with shallots. It was worth the trouble. Shall I pour the white or the dry red? But let it breathe a little first. Who are you, Sam Regal? Never took you for a wine connoisseur. Think witches suck the marrow out of drowner bones and wash it down with bottled water. More or less. <laughs> Long enough on empty stomachs. Let's dig in. Must have cost you a small fortune. Sure you don't need me to pitch in? Please, I manage. You know, a dozen eggs here, a cockogander there. Besides, my finances are about to improve. Why is that? How, if you don't mind my asking? I mean, you'd think the only work to be had in Velen would be in farming. <laughs> Very true. So, I have two options. I can either start cultivating turnips or leave. And? But that's not what I wish to discuss. Thank you once again, Geralt, for your help with the tower. You were fabulous. That's well, true, I'm always fabulous. But among the most difficult, correct? What happened on that I road? mean, not particularly, honestly. Why, I shiver at the thought. And the laboratory. I sincerely hope you burnt everything. The cages, the corpses, the papers. I mean, I, not yet, but I can go back. Didn't destroy that workshop, if that's what you're asking. Didn't see any reason to. If Alexander's findings were to fall into the wrong hands. Although, Fikile has a terrible reputation. None even dare go there. No idea! Perhaps there's nothing to worry about. Fikile scares sorry, the fuck out of people. Such a gloomy subject to broach. I simply shouldn't have, not during our romantic dinner. Romantic? Thought we came here as friends. Friends. With benefits. Amazing. So... Hmm... 
admittedly, I don't know... Okay, I don't know all about their situation. Hmm. I don't know all of Geralt and Yen's situation. Um, sounds like... Yen probably wouldn't be a big fan of this. So I'm gonna go with no, just because... Yen is the one that I'm most interested in, and since this is like giving me an option, like a very clear option, there might be other options, like things that happen where it's a clear option to y'all, but like, uh, I have no idea, and I'm just like, oh, and we're fucking now, okay. But, um, like, right now it's, it's very blatantly like, hey, uh, what about, I'm like, mm, I'm gonna be faithful to Yen, because that's important to me. Like, just in general, I'm not one to... Like, even in games, I'm not super one to, like, be unfaithful to the romantic partners I've chosen. Sorry. There's someone else. <laughs> so what? <sighs> Geralt, Geralt. You're so old-fashioned. Will you at least lie down and gaze at the stars with me? Sure, that sounds like fun. Why not? Don't get me wrong. Kira's really cute. I just really like Yen. She's cool. God, that dress does not cover her. Which one? There's just something I bet. Stars. <laughs> no, it has a different name. A bit indecent, actually. Lean closer, and I'll whisper it in your ear. Egwene Navi. Oh no. Kira. That necklace is going places. Put me to sleep with a spell. Means she's up to something. Mm, Kira, 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 Kira. <sighs> Fike Isle, the tower. And the one popping in and out in the background. <sighs> New quest for the advancement of learning. Um, I have five crowns on she went back to look at the notes herself. Because she did seem really interested in them in, like, a, her own academ- For sake of her own academia. And not just because, oh, we need to burn them all. So I'm kind of almost willing to bet that we're going to find her there. Damn, I thought this was going to be much faster than simply just fast traveling. Was I was I near a fast travel spot? Not really, no. Okay. Shotgun was like, please tell me I haven't just been a massive idiot. I can't see light sources from here, and it almost looks like it might be burning down. I don't know. We'll see close as it loads. Also, speaking of birds, uh, relevance are the birds flo uh, flying around the top. Uh, funny thing, and Assassin's Creed Valhalla, all of the, like, viewpoint things the series is famous for, where you, like, go up super high, then, like, you trust fall into hay or horse shit or what else. Like, whatever else they've chosen. In AC Valhalla, all of the birds that fly around the top of the viewpoints. They just, like, they ripped from one of the older games and then just didn't correctly match the frame rates to? So, like, everything's, like, really gorgeous, sweeping, like, the frame rate's wonderful, and then the birds are, are just really jerkily flapping and moving around and flying in circles, and it <sighs> bothers me. And it's kind of been become a meme a little bit in uh, the house because uh, I've never actually even played Valhalla but one of my housemates was and I was like watching her play it because it's fun to watch people play games sometimes hence you know my channel um oh, and it's like I noticed it and like top floor of the tower. Oh, Kira 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 what you up to Hey, Kira. Setting fire to the place? 
Nope, you got details. So, found what you were looking for? Yes, thanks for asking. How are you feeling? Sleep well? You could have been honest. What do you want with those papers? Why, I aim to use them to continue important work that a man's tragic death put on hold. Um, disease research? Because, I mean, kind of fair. Alexander was studying the Catriona Plague. Okay. I'll use his notes to produce medication, perhaps a cure. Or at least a vaccine. Hmm. Strictly humanitarian motivations, is that it? No, nope. strictly selfish ones. Hmm. The mighty would pay willingly for such a remedy. Can you imagine how much? Take Radovid, for instance. Why, he might even consider forgetting my past associations with the Lodge. Uh, I wouldn't count on that, honestly. Radovid doesn't forget, and Radovid doesn't forgive, especially when it comes to sorceresses. He'll make an exception for me. He'll have to. I have something he wants. What, is like his kid sick with a disease that. or something? Well, you believe Yennefer will stop treating you like a dog someday. Don't see me laughing. <laughs> I'm going to see Radovid. Tell him Fair enough. Fair a fuck enough. That does sound really like a bad idea, though. Suicide killer. You'll wind up tied to a stake, burned to bolster the morals of the masses while entertaining them. Shut up for a moment and look at me. Happily. Could work at Kermorin. Like, go to Kermorin at least. Bed bugs, Geralt. Bloody bed bugs. I, Kira Metz, advisor to Foltest, a member of the Lodge of Sorceresses, have bed bugs. Think what you will, but I'll not stay in this bloody swamp one day more. Not one day. Come to Kira Morin. We can still get you fun, that magical shit. These men will find me sooner or later. Don't you understand? I don't have a choice. I will have to parley. Hey, go to Kira Morin. Another option. Go to Kira Morin. You believe I'd be safe there? No. Yeah. The opposite. When I get there with Siri, oh, I expect I mean, true. to battle the wild hunt. Unbelievable. Have you even been listening to me? Closer than you think. You're not looking for safety. You want your dignity back. You want to be Kira Metz, sorceress of the lodge, not some healer from the swamps who reeks of manure. Giving you an opportunity Radovid won't give you. Go to Kaer Morin. Show everyone what you're made of. <laughs> Yennefer was right. You do have some notion of what women want, how they think. Correct. Yeah, can I have those notes, pretty please? Yeah, kinda. So before I go, I'll need you to hand me those notes. All right, all right, take them already. Thank you, darling. Farewell, Geralt. Or rather, see you soon. I just don't want. Look, Kira, I just don't want you to cause... <laughs> Look, Kira, I just- I don't want you causing witch- witcher verse um, COVID. Honestly, that's- that, that's kind of my- my thought process. Just the start and the stop of it. I just- let's not start- let's- let's not either- <laughs> two, actually, it's two options. Let's not either start Witcher Reverse COVID or release, like, a massive, like, zombie plague. Let's not do either of these things. Both sound like terrible fucking options. So why don't we just not do that? Also, I'm going to go to... Do I have anyone in the White Orchard? I'm going to go to the Royal Palace. Um... Yes, yes, I know the curse. Yes, I know loading screen. Come on, come on, come on. Get with the fucking program. Um. Um. <laughs> I'm so sleepy. So they've been packing and moving heavy furniture for the past six, six days. But still, why am I so tired? Anyway, um. I, I'm gonna do um, Skellige last because of the fact that Skellige is where I need to uh, like I need to go for the final one anyway. 
So, gonna do Nilfgaard, and Monstrous Walking Pains me, and then I'll go to Novigrad um, afterwards. Ah, Geralt! What can I do for you? You can kind of go fuck yourself. I'm kind of just looking for- who can I talk to? No, you're a courier. Courier. I don't! It's just bleached thanks to mutations. I'm curious if I can find the, uh, the, the one noble person. If nothing else, so that later I can come back and get his card. I heard he was in this area somewhere. If not, that's fine. He also could already have left. But I thought maybe, maybe not. Worker. Squares. Okay. Uh, I think it's this direction. Yeah, probably. Hello, guards. What would what what would be to happen if I? No, I just can't do it here. Gosh darn it! I want to cause an international incident. I want to start problems. I want to set Nilf Guard on fire. I want to go to the Emperor and set his sack on fire. <laughs> I want to destroy the Empire of Nilfgaard and everything to do with his infrastructure and it's like those in charge of it. God, I hate empires. And if it hasn't been clear, yes, this does include empires like America, which is, in fact, an empire, for those of you who are uh, unaware of that. Or, it at the very least has an imperialist mindset. Anything, anything nifty? No? Cool. Hey, Amir! Your Imperial Majesty. Hey, you Imperial bitch! Why have you come? Because it's about your fucking daughter. Here he is. Finally, I've begun to doubt the wisdom of enlisting you. Bring her here at once. I'm going to murder you! Her. Here, Morin is the only place she'll be safe. That was not a suggestion. I can defend my own daughter. Mm, no, you can't. I doubt that. Can't compare the wild hunt to Tamarian shield bearers or Lyrian archers. Facing it here would put Vizima at risk. Hundreds of innocents could die. Care Morhen is in a wilderness, and your army stands to be far more helpful there. Correct. Agreed. I shall send a banner with you. On one condition, General Voris will lead it. Don't know who that is. Can't agree to that. And I cannot agree to witches commanding my troops. Well, I'm not about to give in. You don't look it either. Sorry to take up your time, your majesty. Wait, Geralt. City. Go fuck yourself. I will. If that's what she wants. Yeah. Go fuck yourself, Imperial Dicknut. Gods, I hate him. I hate him so much. I... <sighs> I want to take every polearm in this palace and make a piece of art via introducing Emir's body with every single one of those polearms. Do I have a specific idea in mind or a specific layout? No, but it sounds like it would be great fun. God, I just... I so... Yeah. So, so, so fucking hate. Nilfgaardian nobleman. Oh, hey, this is the person. Let's just real quickly see how well this goes. Because apparently he, like, vanishes. No one knows if he dies. He just apparently sometimes will vanish without incredibly apparent prompting. So, ooh, Triss Marigold. Uh, do I have anyone else who's, like, a melee range? Melee range that serves no function. Yeah, your melee range, we have no benefit. Triss. Cool. 
Oh, wait, you count as a hero card? Oh, right, because that's how... Okay, so hero... So hero cards are just anything with a little brass thing. Cool. Um... Sorry, Kira. Oh, honestly, actually, I have nothing in... I have no actual siege machines? So that's a slight problem. Um, I'll go ahead and replace poor fucking infantry with the hope of... No, that didn't do much better. Nausicaa. We'll see how this goes! I am... I don't know... How I feel about this. More specifically, I don't know how I feel about my odds right now. I think... Okay... So... Hmm... If I do this, I'll have a total of eight. Yeah. I'll go ahead and pass it there. Hopefully I'll draw something that's good. Or better, at least. Okay. That works, I think. Question mark. Um, now it is a lot of faking him out. Because I don't have any combo cards now. Now I just have... Cards that are decently strong? And I can... I, admittedly, I can buff one row, because I have my commander's horn. And I can nerf some of the other rows, but I have melee and fog. And fog is for ranged combat, which won't affect his at all, so not super effective, but let's see, I'll play out some things and let's see how it goes. Cool. I'm going to do something similar soon. Ish. And it's not going to affect, yeah, that card. So, uh, I, I'm doing this with the intent of... What's your ability? Oh. No, that's actually very clever. Just thinking about it, because I have four cards. You can see I'll one of them, so... You can kind of predict what I'm going to do. Uh, are you planning on passing? No. Oh, hey, I actually have stronger cards now. Fuck. Fringilla, that's a name I'm kind of vaguely familiar with. I'm really hoping that my horn wasn't the last that wasn't the last card that they're aware of. Yeah. Oh, I'm just boned actually. Fuck. Well, there we go. Okay, I'll come back and kick his ass later. Yeah, that's right. Come on. Okay, so, uh, actually I lied because I decided, hey, um, I actually, uh, want to beat this guy now because I don't know when he's going to disappear and if he's just going to vanish into the mists and, like, I'm- because apparently there's a thing where you can like collect all your- like you can get all of the uh, like there's a quest for getting all the interesting cards. And while so I'm not actually particular concern, con particularly concerned about that one, uh, I like getting the unique cards. 
and I was hoping that it might be something useful. It's just called, it's just full test. Uh, I haven't actually looked at it just yet, but it doesn't sound super interesting. Ooh, that's new. Suggested level 35. Cool, good to know. So next is Novograd. And we're gonna go, I'll, I'll start a Hierarch Square, I believe? This should be close-ish to where Triss is, if I am not entirely off my rocker. Yes, Avalanche was his name. I did, so, getting the nails inked off didn't actually hurt, because it's just the acrylics, not the actual nail itself. That would, <laughs> they'd be bandaged. Um, but I did fuck up when clip, clipping this one, and now that one hurts. Brothers in arms, Novigrad. Also, I can talk to the bank person who's, like, near here, I think. Yeah, bank person, come here! And I think I've beaten you and Gwent. How can I be of Yeah, I need to, the, yeah, that. Got some coin. Come to the right. Also, alone, Geralt, no, that's the worst evil possibly imaginable. I say this with some levity, but also not much. <laughs> Where is... Triss! I want to go talk to the slutty mage. Surprising no one, the slutty mage wants to go talk to the slutty mage. I just, I love, I love her. She has such a good aesthetic. Also, so far I've seen, I think, all the mages, oh. You are? That's a really interesting hypothesis that you have there. Yeah. You think you're gonna kill me? I'm not even actually, like, using my sword, and I'm, like, you know, doing pretty damn good, if I may say so myself. Sucks to suck. That's... Sure, a sentence that you just said. Yes. Who are you here for? Triss. Triss. Told her from the start. No men, no pets. It is a decent house for decent folk. Don't worry, won't stay long. <laughs> Talk, landlord. Landlord, landlady, cool, you're in the categories of individuals I can lie to. Because I generally speaking don't lie, but like... Landlords and cops, it's, it's permissible. I will go on the record for saying that, yes. God, I love your wardrobe. I, I aspire to dress in such a tits outlook as Triss does. That is genuinely just my ideal aesthetic. Yes, Geralt? God, you're so pretty! See, you kept the rose of remembrance I gave you in Flotsam. It seems so long ago. Probably because so much has changed. So, sentimental value. That why you kept it? Partly. Though, more as a warning. Fair enough. Yeah, you holding up okay? It'll be a hard slog for everyone. You know what I mean. What am I supposed to say? I mean, I knew you and Yennefer. We'd end up back together. It was a lost cause. Always. I'm sorry. I guess so. I just don't want you to... Can we not dwell on it? I need to focus on other things now. Yeah, that's fair. I'm very sorry about the very unfortunate circumstances that have led and put you in this situation. I'm so sorry. I'm not even responsible for them, and I'm so sorry, because... Ow, oh, that hurts! Mm, so, so. Why do you ask? <sighs> um... <laughs> Maybe we should talk about something else. Gladly. I was about okay. to... Okay! Hell, are you even another grad? Question mark? Long enough to know how not to get caught and survive. And before you came here, where were you? Oh, places. Where I managed to get by without your help, too. 
Which doesn't mean I'm not happy to see you. Um, yeah, it seems like you have something on your mind. What did you want to talk about? I got a strange message. I didn't quite know what to think. Who was it from? Ingrid Vagelbutt's servant. Apparently, Lady Vagelbutt's prepared to donate a tidy sum. She wants to help mages escape from Novigrad. Guessing this wouldn't be a selfless act of charity. Mm, you guess right. And that's my problem. Vagelbutt needs a favor from me. No details in the letter, unfortunately. I'm well then, that does sound like a problem. Schneider. Says he needs to explain everything face to face, but these days I can't be sure meeting him is a good idea. Yeah, let me help you out. Don't like this at all, but you seem determined. Not about to let you deal with it alone. Thank you. The servant. How are you supposed to contact him? Said I'd recognize him. He'll be in a blue tunic, have a load of keys strapped to his belt. I'm supposed to ask him about the price for his trout. Oh my. For the price of his trout, you say? Whose idea you think this was? The servants or vagal buds? My bet's on Ingrid. High Vagal Buttons have a lot more time than their servants to read adventure novels. I think it'll be better if I talk to the mystery man in the blue tunic. He's expecting to meet me. You just wait nearby. I'll make sure that note didn't come from the witch hunters. Then you come in. Mm hmm. Fine. Let's meet there. That sounds like a good plan, because, um. Fuck the witch hunters. Or rather, more, express more explicitly. Uh, pointedly, uh, don't fuck the witch hunters, unless you're uh, unless you are um, encouraging them to get into the power sander. But other than that, no. God, it was one of my friends came up with that one a while ago, and I'm just like, that, that's really good. That that mm, that scratch is good. It's in the back of my brain. Okay, so it's cabaret. No, dangerous game. Ah, eh, what's your what? What was your quest's name? Oh gosh. I don't. I didn't see what the title was for that. Oh, there it is. Okay, a matter of life and death. It's like I need to know where to go. Hi, I'm gonna beat the shit out of you again, once again with my bare hands for some reason. I don't know why I'm not pulling out my sword, but you know. I clearly don't need it. No bread, no coin, all is like, dang, how badly do you have to be off that you're, like, your henchman? Can we take it out by a single, like, upper middle-aged dude with his fists? Just any time. How's that feel, huh? Lots of blue jerkins. Interesting. Blue jerkins, no. Oh, hey, keys. Yeah. Know where I can get the best price on trout? Perhaps. But it wasn't you I was to meet, sir. Want to talk to the letter's recipient? I gotta be present. Caution would advise. Caution's advising you not to argue right now. Trust me. Yeah. It seems I've got no choice. <laughs> yeah, I, I have also two good reasons. Caution and intelligence. There are two great swords on my back. <laughs> yeah, I have two wonderful reasons why you should uh, not complain too much. This one's called reason. This one's called caution. I mean... Y'all drew on us, so I don't know what else you were going to expect, if not to die. Anyone else want to go? 
I would also would have a little, uh, a bit of a lock and, you know, try your luck. No! no. Recently, someone's been trying to question our messengers about the young count. Oh? Where's Miss Merigold? <sighs> you would come alone, miss. If not for him, that trio would have dragged you in for questioning. The tall one was Valdo Morris. Works for the witch hunters. Aye. Oh, God. You're really right, miss. I, it, it just weren't what I expected since Lady Bagel, bud. Ah, oh, my back is fucked up a bit. That's fine. Yeah, so what's all this about, actually? Or just be direct. You don't have to be straight, just direct. Master Albert's taken an interest in alchemy. Temple guards got wind. Wouldn't worry about the guard. But since the mage hunters tried to grab you, I'd say Albert's in serious trouble. Aye. Lady Bagelbud bought off the guardsmen. Since the hunters paid for every mage revealed to him. Guardsmen took a bribe from the frightened family, and whispered a word to the hunters anyway. I hate. Seems Albert <laughs> to disappear as soon as possible. I, I hate understand. witch hunters. I hate everything they stand for. I hate everything they enable. I hate everything about them. Master Albert's in hiding at the Bagel Buds country estate. Lady Ingrid's got the notion she can get him out quietly. Want to throw a lavish masquerade ball? Am I supposed to attend? Help him escape? I will not manage without you, Miss. Lady Bagel Bud fears the help's being watched. Yes, that's fair. That's a good idea. A boisterous bash that'll distract the hunters. Especially if even half of what I've heard about the Vagal Buds balls is true. Word oh, is please, you're telling me more about the Vagal Buds balls. Desserts, and the fireworks boom from dusk till dawn. What Sounds like a hefty situation. The ladies ordained but 85 desserts this time. Won't be no candy petals or blue roses from the Zair. The roses have become dreadfully hard to come by. <laughs> oh, I'd love to Amazing. see Amazing. <laughs> yeah, we can do this, but I'm going with Triss. Stay till the end. You're coming with me? Of course I am. Not about to send you into what could prove to be the lion's den by yourself. Yeah, no, that'd be ridiculous. Eighty-five desserts. Well, you're still trying to keep your waist at twenty-two inches. Carol, please. How do we get to the residence? Your invitation. Sure, it's slightly messed up. Guard of the gate will have instructions for you. You're to wear a fox mask, all right? Good luck to you. I mean. Girl's more of the wolf type, but okay. Uh, my girlfriend likes foxes, though. Think we can head there now? You're kidding, right? We have to prepare, change clothes, most importantly, buy our masks. I bet you can get everything we need for the ball at Ellie House shop. You know it? Been there before. Ellie's a friend of Dandelions. Makes Just sense. Just masks, right? Probably don't need to wear a doublet, do I? I take care of that. Oh, oops. Soon. Not bad. Something probably cute and flirty, though. There's no crash again. Buy a fox mask. Alright, I'm gonna go get the mask, and we're going to go arrive. Then I'm gonna call it for this episode. Cause, cause, I have... Uh, I have another thing to record for y'all tonight. This admittedly... It's 11 at the moment. So I might actually not get this up by the time it rolls over to Tuesday. Deepest apologies. I I think my body's just been recovering from moving, because just my body's been like, oh, you want to do anything? Go fuck yourself. Oh, this one! I like this friend. Um you sleeping? Oh, there you are. I was like, hey, greetings. Come to look over my spring collection, perhaps? Yes. Oh, you like art? Fun. Glad to take a glance at what you got. Of course, please do. If anything chafes or pinches, I can alter it on the spot at no charge. Once I'm done, it'll feel like you're wearing nothing at all. I mean, yes, please. Triss's fox man. Elegant mask. Elegant mask. So I need the mask just for Triss? So.
Greetings. Glad to take. I I'll go ahead and grab. I'll go ahead and go with a fox mask, or a wolf mask. Then, God, all of these just look so bad. Uh, let's see. I'll go with that one. And... Oh, please tell me this one is an elf guardian. No, good, okay. I'll go with this one because it's strappy and I like things with lots of straps. They're very cool. So long. Can I wear it? No, I can't wear the fox mask. Fox mask. Oh, uh, can I not even wear the wolf mask? But I wanted to wear the funny wolf mask. Oh, I can't wear the, the the wolf mask. Oh, this makes me happy. Can I wear the fox mask? No, I can't. That's unfortunate. The Potestquisitor. Yep, nothing, nothing suspicious here. Not at all. This is... Hello, I am a person from out of town. Cannot you see that I am of the noble class? Hello, other nobles. I am a normal noble man. I am not here to do violence to people. I am not here for um any potentially nefarious or... Um, less than things that you would like to happen purposes? No, why would you want to think of this? I, I am offended. This is, this is called an affront. You are doing an affront to me, sir. Interesting. <laughs> oh. Better up! Oh, there's more of you! I love it when people make poor decisions! Mmm, tasty. You know, I've had chicken. I I've had chicken wing. I've not had. Uh oh. Or they're talking about me. Hello! Oh, you look gorgeous. Geralt. Hello. Like you. So? Nothing. Just, you look good when you're giddy. Hello, you Triss. Know anything else about Albert? Well, almost none of the mages have heard of him. An amateur, I guess. So why the interest? I do really like that dress. That looks very good. I would love to wear something like that. Not quite built for it just yet, but I'm working on that. Everything's ready. We can go. Just a shame you didn't dress up like I asked. I got new stuff. You expected me to show up in a lacework collar, ruffles on my trousers. You'd even look great wearing a bustle. Dad, I want to know what that is. For now, you'll just have to survive on bread and Witcher. <laughs> well then, shall we go? Oh, I didn't get boots. Are really, the boots that big of a deal? I mean, I suppose. At least I'm wearing a smile. Greetings, my lord, my lady. We're Lady Ingrid Vagelbutt's guests. Your invitation, please. It's an order. You'll find Lady Vagelbutt in the estate's yard. Look for the parrot mask. Now, one more thing. I'll leave your swords here, please. Yes. Yeah. Some mistake. You know why we're here, don't you? Of course. But I've orders to make certain every guest enters the estate unarmed. Damn it. <laughs> A pleasant evening to you both. It's beautiful here. 
Damn it, I couldn't, like, axie my way out of this. Can I still... I mean, the good news is, if things go south, I do just have my signs. There's been a mistake. I don't know you, sir. Don't be foolish, Vivian. I'd recognize that maid anywhere. You might play the great dame now, but before that Baron Edward something pulled you from the gutter, you were a common. Enough. The lady said she doesn't know you. Who's this? The new one? Older than the last, it seems. Can I please punch him? Prick. So, the less they can, the more they pay. Is that it? Let's go, Triss. Wouldn't want to make a scene. Yeah. Hey! Oh, I liked you much better when you worked the carriages outside the passive floor. Oh, I want to punch him, but we're here. Okay. No, draft. I really wanted to punch him. So badly. You're a dork. And drunk, probably. Whenever I get tipsy, I just gush about how wonderful my girlfriends are. You do miss Miracle. Well, well. And I was led to believe this would be an elegant affair. I'll punch you too, dick! But can we put that aside for now? Do you have a way Oh, her mask is just my mask, but painted orange. That's hilarious. Join you? And just who would I join? Your friends, among others. Once we've all gathered, I'll lead you. You will lead. Forgive me, Marigold, but that is like allowing myself to be led by a lame duck. I mean, at least you'd survive. God, that dress is so cool looking. Who was that? Who is that? He's an old friend. His name's Moritz Dyfenfell. Tell you the story later. Okay. All right. Oh, let's look around. Yeah, let's try to avoid any more cutscenes because I just want to talk to the lady. Oh wait, I was supposed to stop before we actually entered the party. There's a cutscene. Excuse me, Miss. We'll yes, talk to her, then we'll end it. The trout fire. Hmm? Oh yes, of course. Please excuse the precautions, but. We could speak somewhere in private. Sure. Retrospect does kind of make me happy because complicated reasons that honestly I don't need to explain. But I like the wolf fox motif thingy. It's cute. I prefer as few as possible new of Albert's flight. But if you trust this man, I would say that's putting it lightly. That's cute. I almost said that's gay, which isn't true. Since they attacked me Sadly. The market, no. Though Trust does give me big buy energy. But I bribed a man of the Temple Guard. He claims there's more and more talk of Albert's new ranks. How did the guardsmen learn about your son's interests to begin with? Oh, unfortunately, I cannot be sure Albert himself was not the source. Merely boasting about an experiment. He's careless that way. I mean, like to be fair, proud of one's work. Man, but a dimwit. Devoured by an Arrakis. I don't know if you've heard. Yeah. Amazing. Must have traveled far and wide. Hardly. He attempted to breed them. <laughs> amazing. 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 Yeah, let's go get Albert. Let's get Albert. Where is he? Entertaining the guests. He's always been an outsized presence at my receptions. I preferred not to arouse any suspicions. When can we take him away? We shall have to wait until the guests have imbibed enough to notice only the goblet-laden trays. Don't fret. It won't be long. Mm-hmm. Is Albert ready to leave? Is your son ready to go? We'll have to act quickly. Yes, I've seen to everything. Where will you take him? Care more in. You're better off not knowing any details. You'll be safe, I promise. But please, trust me. It's not the first time I've done this. I know. Thank you. Yeah, how will we recognize what mask he's wearing? 
He's donned a panther mask. He knew you were due to come for him. Seemed rather excited, ironically. I'm afraid he's not fully comprehended the danger he faces. As I said, he's not terribly bright. Don't worry about that. He'll fit right in with a good number of the other mages. Geralt! Let's go find him. I shall await word from you. It sounds very very much so like it's one of those very high That's intellect, very high common, or very low wisdom situations. I almost said low common sense, but common sense is actually not really a factual thing. That's a whole other thing for another time. Now it's like a very good time to leave off, so uh, thank you everybody so much for watching. If you're enjoying what we're doing here, please uh, like. If you have any fun things to say, comment and subscribe. If you can, please go check out the Kofi in the link in the, in the description. There's lots of cool different rewards for being a subscriber, um, from things from choosing cosplay that I can wear, to adding games that if like there's a game that you want to see, putting on the list of things that I will actually play. Like you can just that's the thing you can just do. Uh, it is expensive because these things take a lot of time, but it is a thing that you can do. Uh, also, uh, if you can't do that, just tell a couple of friends because that would really help. Just the more people who help, then I can do more things for the channel, like get customize the URL, and that helps. Make sponsors take me more seriously, and that's just make sure that I can help keep putting these videos out. So, until next time, please, thank you everybody so much for watching. I hope you're having a wonderful day wherever you are. Please, do not forget to be kind to yourselves and one another. And for now, it is time for some very important things. All the thanks in the void to my Voiditsians over on Kofi, Darius, Sarah Senpai, and Jinxed Mutt. If you'd like to join the ranks, head over to Kofi, choose a subscription tier, and enjoy various benefits such as your own customized Discord emoji, the chance to sell me your immortal soul, access to the Voiditsian only Discord server, and much, much more. As always, don't forget to hydrate, masticate, and medicate.